This video was brought to you by Stoltenberg, Abed Root Planner, Mr. Green, Ken Power, and Marcus Biel. Yo, what's up? This is the Mercedes EQS SUV, or I just call it the Fat EQS. And in this video, I'm gonna find out how much space it has by putting in banana boxes. But you know, you might be thinking, oh, but the biggest cars, they are Tesla, right? Or maybe some other brand, some German brand. No, guess what? The four biggest cars in my test, they are all Chinese. So, can this big fat EQS beat the Chinese cars? We'll find out. Yes, this is the big showdown. Okay, we don't have to look in the front because there is no front. Let's look in the back instead. So because this is a proper German luxury car, we have kick sensor that actually works. Huh? Well, what do you expect? This car cost 1.9 million nook. <laughs> so here, look at this. We have so much space here. It's like, it's like the EQS that had been stretched in the height here. I don't... What the heck is this thing? Some kind of weapon? And here we can take out this lid and that frees up a lot of space. Ooh. And look here. Here we have the 12 volt battery. Huh, interesting. I wonder why they put it in the back, not in the front. Okay, I'll just leave the lid here. And then we have some buttons over there. I'm just looking for more stuff we can open up. I was like, wait, this one. Oh, 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 look, look here, look here, look here, look here. That is a fast erection. Oh, the Antakke coupling is here. Look here. We can tilt the seat upwards like this. I can still sit comfortably, but you can also push it forward. Oh, now we're cooking. Wait, wait, wait. How far? Wait, 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 wait. This is still good. This is still approved by Toyota drivers. Yeah, I'm gonna use this configuration to get maximum space in the back. Right, round one, in the trunk, wait. Oh, okay, okay, it's just a bad kick from me. So, how many? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, wait, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13. That is still less than the Chinese cars. Hmm. Okay, let's fold the seat and then we try to beat the Chinese. You know, A, B, C always beat Chinese. Look here, we have some buttons here. If I push them forward. Oh, 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 look what happens now. Huh? Huh? We can also do the other one simultaneously. Huh? <laughs> wow, you see the, this, the front seat even uh, moves forward. Huh? Do you have this in your Chinese car? Nah, I thought so. Oof. I tried to put in as many as possible without ruining the interior. Yeah, you see, always, I mean, all the way to the top. This, I mean, let me show you here. Uh, I don't know if you can see it there. That screen takes up some valuable space. So, yeah, uh, and you cannot remove that screen. So, it kind of limits how many banana boxes you can put in there. Here we try to put in as many as possible. Same here on this side. That freaking screen there, man. You see it? Shit. Okay, whatever. Okay, as always, let's turn up the pitch and start counting. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, Four, twenty-five, twenty-six. Huh? What the heck happened here? This car has the same space as a Model Y. No, 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 it can't be. It can't be, man. Trunk is. Well, actually, is the trunk bigger? Uh. Well, yeah. I, I'm not sure. I think the problem is that um, a banana box has a certain shape, and then sometimes you simply can't fit all of them 
in the perfect way. And then maybe the Model Y was just lucky that the banana boxes fit perfectly. Or, well, actually, Model Y also has a little frunk. This one doesn't have it. But I can show you here the problem. See, that's the problem. It's that freaking screen. Or well, both of the screens. They eat up space. So, yeah, maybe we could have fit in two or three more banana boxes if the screens were not there. It's wise niche, but okay, a test is a test, and now we have proven it in the most scientific way. <laughs> Maybe I should start filling up the car with water, or I don't know. You know, back in the old days, before I invented this test, I was thinking about putting uh, toilet paper in the car. That could be quite messy, yeah. So I think I'll just stick with the banana boxes. So yes, I think that's gonna be it for now. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. As always, thank you for watching and talk to you later.